I guess this is my virtual hello to Nicole and the San Diego County Office of Education. My name is Kim Arvidson. I am a third grade teacher at Impresa Elementary and work for the Vista Unified School District. I have been named their Elementary Teacher of the Year. I am very excited about this honor. It's very humbling and very inspiring at the same time. You asked me to tell you a little bit about myself. I've been teaching 30 years. I can't believe it. It feels like it's just year one. I'm still as passionate as ever about teaching and the influence it can have on the youth of America. I am married and have two children. My husband is a teacher, my daughter is a teacher, and my son is a senior in college graduating with a history degree and planning on also going into education. You wanted to know a little bit about my hobbies. I love skiing, I love reading, um, I love Scrabble. I'm actually the Scrabble coach at Impresa Elementary. We have a big district tournament that is a lot of fun. I'm passionate about science and integration of science across all curriculum areas. So those are my four big passions. Um, you wanted a short phrase that told about me. I would have to say it's one of our class mottos, which is be the reason someone smiles today. I feel like if you keep that focus that you're not only going to have a great day, but you're going to help a whole lot of other people have a great day. Um, you asked how it felt to be selected as Teacher of the Year. I mean, amazing. That is the one word that comes to mind. Um, as far as distance learning, we're calling it virtual learning in our district. It has been challenging, but at the same time, it has been extremely rewarding to think about lessons being delivered virtually and how a child sitting in their home with a laptop in front of them will be taking in that learning. It has totally flipped how I am thinking about education and my lesson delivery. I love daily touching base with my students through our daily story time. I send them a video every morning with a morning message, kind of reviewing what the lessons are going to be that day, reaching out through our Google Classroom. So it's definitely been a learning experience, but I'm seeing it as a positive one. If I can't be in my classrooms, at least I'm still able to inspire my students to learn and have a passion for learning. Um, uh, in order to inspire the teachers around me, you asked me to give you give some helpful words. I would say, just be yourself. This is new, and the good thing is it's not going to be forever. And so do the best that you can. Lean on your colleagues, and remember, we're all in this together. Convey that to your families, that this is new to you, it's new to them, and if we keep that philosophy of we're all in this together, the outcome is going to be amazing. Thanks, I hope to meet you all soon in person, but until then, here's my virtual goodbye.